Hey everybody, it's me, Justin, aka Goodwill Hunter, and I'm hungover, and I'm back off vacation, and we're at Park Ave, so let's do some thrifting, because I haven't done thrifting, and I kind of need to get my thrift on, so let's head on in. Alright people, got out of Park Ave, we're here at the Goodwill up in Johns Creek, and we found some stuff. I don't know if it was the alcohol burning off my body, uh, but I made some purchases, and uh, here's what I got. I got a sealed copy of Dance Dance Hottest Party 2. Apparently this is part of some sort of a bundle, I don't know, for four bucks, sealed. Yeah, I'll flip that. Got another PlayStation 2 DualShock controller. Four bucks, again, it's the H series. Again, it's missing one of the pins, but that's pretty common. So instead of nine pins, I'm sorry, I said uh, it had six pins. There's nine pins, but on the H series, there's only eight for some reason. So maybe it works, maybe it doesn't. I got a army uh, patrol cap. Uh, we used to call them uh, covers in the Marine Corps. So it's an army cover or otherwise known as a UCP patrol cap seven and seven eighths. So not sure if that's big or bad. Sell it online for like 10, 15 bucks. And then I found a The Batman Plug and Play by Jack Specific. Looks like it's, uh, I don't know. I don't know if it's good or bad, but for four bucks, I decided it's a plug and play I didn't have, I'd pick it up. Really glad that I found this. Uh, I think I've seen this uh, a couple of times uh, on like people's reviews. Uh, I think it's got batteries and it's probably, they're all shot to hell, but it's the Dragon Ball Z uh, Jack Specific. It's got the game key where you could buy cartridges to plug in to play different games um, but it's got uh, what's his face uh, Shenron and uh, the different buttons I'm not sure what kind of game it is but it's in nice condition for four bucks so excited to see what that's got but here this is what I was really excited to find I got a sharp color TV old school with the dials it's got the dials oh yeah so Really excited, turned it on, it works. Uh, it's color, it's not black and white, so I'm thinking I can hook up uh, some sort of a coax to the uh, UHF, VHF uh, little forks. And I'll play some old school Atari, my Famicom. I wanna see if uh, the old Famicom will hook up. It goes up to, I think it's 80 something, so I'm not sure I've heard you have to go up to like 90 something, so who knows. But we're here at the Goodwill in Johns Creek. Let's see what we can find here. It's Thursday, I get my discount, so fingers crossed, fingers crossed. I found some shit, guys. Let's get to it. I found this fat PS2, came with a memory card and the DVD receiver. Uh, it looks like it's been opened, but it did work, and uh, it was only 15 bucks, so I decided I'd uh, pick it up. Never hurts to have an extra. Two Nintendo controllers. They were $3.93 a piece. Always good to have. Found a loose Sega Dreamcast for 10 bucks. Don't even know if it powers on, but uh, hey, it looks like it's in okay, decent condition. Mr. Uh, Clean Magic Erasers work great on these. The last thing I picked up was a Super Nintendo game, ironically, that I didn't have. It's Porky Pig's Haunted Holiday. It's by uh, Acclaim and Sunsoft, so maybe that's good, maybe that's bad, who knows. Uh, but again, five bucks, that's a good deal. Really good deal. So guys, that'll do it for the day. It looks like uh, I'm gonna head back to work, get something to eat, and uh, edit this video. Haven't been out there in a while, so it's nice to find some gaming-related stuff when you hit the thrift stores. Always a plus. So as always, guys, make sure to leave a comment below. If you liked it, hit the thumbs up. If you didn't like it, and what are you waiting for? Hit that unsubscribe button. As always, guys, keep up the thrift, and I'll thrift with you later. When I was a kid, I thought that having my own arcade would be impossible. But as an adult, I realized you don't have to be rich. With determination and a few good friends, it's not impossible. Yeah.